YouTube guys I accidentally deleted my last video that was at 11.30 a.m. now it's 12.30 a.m. too funny this is a pretty good video we'll try again uh, just stopped at a garage sale and I scored four empty propane tanks, five bucks a piece. Frickin' awesome. Cost me about 15, 20 bucks a piece to get them filled. But that's, that's a huge thing, man. That's cooking and heating. With propane, when you cook, there's no smoke. It's not like lighting a fire where they can actually track down the smoke. You can still smell the food, but you can still smell what you're cooking. But it's so comforting knowing I have extra propane tanks laying around ready to use. Oh, wait. I don't have 11 propane tanks. I didn't just buy four more at a garage sale for 20 bucks. <laughs> Too funny. Those uh, propane tanks, the little ones, the little Coleman ones, you can actually get an adapter and fill the Coleman propane tanks off of a regular propane tank for your grill. It's cool, man. I seen a video on that one. I still haven't bought the adapter kit yet, but that was cool. And I knew there was some way to fill them, I just didn't know how. We bought a bunch of those little Coleman coolers for uh, Coleman bottles for one of the stock car races we went to last year. Uh, two containers lasted all weekend. So even those little ones, they work. They work. And the smaller the the stove, you can just carry it with you. You know? So yeah, score. Uh, a little bit every day, guys. Uh, I'll throw those back in the back shed. Keep back to the collection little bit every day, guys. A little bit every day. As far as I know, all you guys are ahead of the curve. As far as the rest of America. I just left a customer's house and I promise you they got about a week's worth of food and that's it. Super nice house on a lake. probably got about a week's worth of food in that house. So if we can make it 30, 45 days, 60, 60 days tops, we're, we're going to be, it's going to be huge for us. Yesterday, there's a true value hardware store going out of business. Unbelievable. But everything was 10 to 70% off. And uh, I scored some lamp oil. I got six or eight bottles of lamp oil. You know, the old hurricane lamps that you see in the old movies? They had them in the westerns and stuff. I don't have 29 of those. That's light and heat. And depending on the size of the meal you're trying to cook. You know, if you're cooking a can, you can throw that right over the top of the lamp oil. An oil lamp and cook. So yeah, 
yeah, a little bit, a little bit here, a little bit there, guys. A little bit here, a little bit there. Just stopped in a little one horse town. So we got a good little restaurant there, and I don't mind helping out the locals. It's been at least eight, ten, twelve years since I've ate a taco. Uh, Taco Bell, well, no, I can't say that. Uh, McDonald's. We were in Alaska. We had to hit a Taco Bell one time. So that's probably my last fast food. I try not to eat that shit. So, yeah, a little bit at a time, man. I just bought a bunch of lamp oil and I found some propane tanks. School. Pick up an extra thing of toothpaste, guys. Believe it or not, hygiene is going to be huge. I just happen to have packs and packs of bar soap. No electric. I, I go right down to the creek and wash my clothes. So, yeah. Uh, oh, I bought Zippo fluid, too. They had some Zippo, Zippo fluid on sale. Probably got nope. I probably don't have six, eight containers of Zippo fluid. <laughs> All right. Well, hopefully this weekend I get to do some little skill training for the grandkids. Maybe break out the wrist rockets. I do have a bow and arrow, a little compound bow. Maybe we'll let them practice with that. A little bit every day, guys, okay? A little bit every day. Praying for you. Praying for the world. Peace.